Okay, so, um, I had to drive from the university picking up my graduation garb, and then that was at 9, this starts at 10, so that drive home was the craziest drive home I've ever been in. Nintendo, please make this day- I'm graduating today, if you don't know, so hey, that's cool. Uh, well, I mean, I've, I've graduated already, but I'm convocating, so make this day awesome, please. Now to wait. 10 o'clock, let's do this. Oh, here we go. Okay. Smash countdown always makes me hype. Uh, if they start with Smash, I'll cry. But if they end with it, I'll cry harder. Okay, Bayonetta 3 confirmed. Probably gonna be there. Okay, so it's not starting just with Smash. That's fine. Well, maybe. Mess me up, Nintendo. Let's go. What? Okay, we're starting with mechs? What is this? Is this a new custom robo? There's no way. No, this doesn't look like custom robo. Unless it is? This is something to start the show off with. Is this a new platinum game? This looks like platinum. Wait, is this the one? No, it's not. No, this looks like platinum though, 100%. This is cool looking. I like the art style actually a lot. It reminds me very much of an old sort of PS2 game. Wait, I saw the word Damon appear. Damon X? This is not a Nintendo game I would have expected. Unless this isn't Nintendo, this is just a big third party game. Which it could be. Oh, this is such a platinum game. Cross slash is always cool. Okay, this is dope. But will it mech America great again? I still can't get over that tagline. Okay, let's see a title. I just... Damon X Mac Machina. Is it... Is it Platinum? Marvelous! That's the Senran Kagura, guys? Are you serious? Okay. This is... Yeah, this is uh, Xenoblade Chronicles X DLC. Thought so. See, see until I see Xenoblade. Yeah, I saw Xenoblade there, so at least someone got it. This is uh, revealed in the game if you play it, but... So this is... It looks like... That's a Final Fantasy boss. So yeah, the leak about it being a prequel is super true. Hey, he has the Monado. I hope they finally explain why. Whoa, okay, we get to see what Adam looks like. I haven't seen him. If he appears in the game, I haven't seen what he looks like. Oh wait, it's a young versions of all the bad guys. Huh. Oh, it's so weird that you get to just play as the bad guys. Who beeped me on my phone? Nintendo of America. I should probably mute that. That looks more like who I thought it would be. Wow, this is a lot more than I expected for... Oh, what? It has a unique system? Huh. Yeah, that's a whole new sort of... Also, hey, spoilers, some of these characters are blades. Also, spoilers, there's awesome mechs in the game. 2018, you're the mech! As usual, music is, is phenomenal. Torna, the Golden Country. That's a really good subtitle. I mean, you could have even just done the Golden Country. But I guess you can call it... Xenoblade 2 Torna, and that works. When we launched hey! Switch, our, our vision was a home system you could play together anytime, It's my favorite anywhere. dude. My favorite Pizza Hut CEO. Two controllers, countless, countless play possibilities. 
from day one, all of you have shown the world. Are we seeing a Switch 2.0 thing? Or on the go, from low to on high. Where will Nintendo Switch take you next? To a smashing invitation. Oh, smash! He said the word! Or on a journey through verdant fields and Viridian cities. In a, in a oh, Viridian City. That's Pokemon. Catch them all. Oh, he's, yeah, he's playing Pokemon. A few weeks ago, we showed you Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu, Pikachu better version. A brand new Pokemon adventure. Through the I went on Amazon and like the Eevee version was like at the top of the pre-orders and Pikachu was like part way down. I always like to get the lesser version. power of Nintendo Switch and you can play as you like, anywhere you like, or for the first time in this series catch or battle pokemon on one system that's going to be super broken even like there's no dual from pokemon go there's no dual um this like battles is a pokeball plus you can, you can use it like a joy-con controller with pokemon let's go pikachu and let's go eevee but or play the entire game with it alone you can you can put a pokemon into the pokeball plus then is it just yeah nintendo's gonna keep tweeting i'm just gonna put that down Sounds like there's already one. That's a new crop. Oh, it's Mew. Pokemon Mew. Mew comes exclusive with every Pokeball. What? You just get Mew? That really defeats the purpose of Mew. That defeats the purpose of being one of the rarest Pokemon ever. Okay, it's fine. That's one way to get it into Go, I guess. Wherever you go, with whoever you like. Are you gonna show us the new Pokemon? Now. Let's check out something else we can't wait to show you. Smash? Okay, are you ready for this? All right. He's desperate. Don't need it. This is better than the Ubisoft fake gamers. All or nothing. Oh, Mario Party! <gasps> is Mario Party back to being a normal board game? Super Mario Party! Okay! It's back on a no. It's back on. Also, I saw someone say nobody does this. I've done it before. What? We need to have like some angles. Okay. That looks cool. Ready? Do it. Oh, game on. Okay. Oh my God. That's really cool. It's a lot more. It's a lot more sensical now that more people have multiple. Like people have more than one Switch. But I hope we can just play it normally. That's interesting. So it looks like they've done a way to sort of drag it to make it be the um playable Goomba. To be like the um the the multiple screens. Is that playable just Bowser? Oh yeah, Bowser's just playable. That's kind of new and interesting. Also, was that a Koopa kid I saw playable? Diddy Kong. That's interesting. Dry Bones is back. That's good. Everyone wants to play Dry Bones. Okay, I have a problem. Goombas don't. Goombas don't have hands. This looks like a good Mario Party. Yeah, I'm down for that. That's coming out real soon too. I'm sorry. Is that? Oh, Fire Emblem. Long ago, the divine Seros received a revelation from the goddess, a gift. Yeah, it's playing an organ fire emblem theme. Okay, let's see this. Now, the goddess watches over Fodlan. From her yep, that above, is the fire emblem art style. Do we still have the same? It looks like the same character designer, which is good. That dude's cool. Fire emblem three houses. Wait, is this Game of Thrones? What? It's Game of Thrones? Okay. That looks really cool. Oh, I like the touch that you bring soldiers with you, which makes more sense for a war game. Such a brutal, irrational world we live in. Some believe the crests, tokens of the goddess's this power. Edelgard, she is she the main character? But they're wrong, teacher. The crests are to Oh, this is cool.
That's what I wanted. Okay, after the the walking around in echoes, I'm like, we need we need to have just a a being able to walk around in a fire emblem. Oh, this is interesting. Or do you play as generic blue haired lord actually? Oh, and you got social links. Oh, that's cool. I bet you all these characters are in Smash. Everyone. All these generic soldiers. See, this makes so much more sense for war, having troops with each commander, because it makes no sense otherwise. Oh, that's cool. We got some, some Automaton stuff. That is a blue-haired lord. People said ugly graphics, and like, what are you literally talking about? You know what? I hate Twitch chat, because they're always wrong. Go away. Thank you. Yeah, man. That looks like Tiki, almost. Well, we're just going. Viva Pinata 2, baby! Oh, no. It's even worse. Also, I realize there's already a Viva Pinata. This is, like, out now, so, like, why would you be advertising it? I mean, okay. I will say, it doesn't make sense for people to hate this being on the console, because it does make sense, it's one of the biggest third-party third games ever right now, so it makes sense for that- wait, is this Fortnite? I can't even tell. Yeah, it is. It makes sense for, it, for them to want it on Switch, like, this is a pull for people, to have a portable, good Fortnite, but, god, I do not care. Put in a Mario character or something. Throw in, like, playable Link. Yeah, there you go. Play for free, today, now. Oh, it's in an hour. I can't wait to drop off the battle bus and meet some of you okay. on the battle. Nothing new on the screen, but Stardew Valley is number one there. Nintendo Switch, you can have the complete Battle Royale experience. Whether playing together online with Reggie, you don't have to explain room, Fortnite to us. It's world. literally one of the most Available popular games right now. There was a nine-year-old girl who went to rehab because she was addicted to it. Reggie, we know what Fortnite is. Including a wealth of groundbreaking games from our independent Okay, indies, here we go. Your support for indie games on Nintendo Switch has We're probably gonna see Indivisible and Bloodstained. I feel like out of every company, Nintendo would be the one to push them. Behind these rich and varied experiences. From all of us here at Nintendo, thank you. Let's pull back the curtain on a few more, including two we're showing for the first time okay. here today. Aspiring chefs. Oh yeah, this one was leaked. I tried overcooked, and this game is way too stressful for me. I can't handle it. Like I, I, I it's like. It, this game caused me to actually lose social link points with a friend. With friends. I, I hate it. Like, I get the appeal, but I can't do it. I'm stressing out just looking at this. I can see the appeal, but, oh, no, I'd rather just play a competitive game than a... Oh, Killer Queen Black! Yes, this game's apparently super awesome. Also, it's a... Jojo reference. Liquid Bit and Bumble Bear Games acclaimed arcade extravaganza that became a multiplayer phenomenon is coming. It's a rare arcade game, so this is like really good that we're getting it. That's cool. Play it first on Nintendo Switch later this year. And finally, Venture. Yeah, that's a game that people really like. Apparently, this is a good uh, Metroidvania type. In Teen Cherry's Hollow Knight, an action adventure filled with gripping combat and haunting secrets. Hand drawn characters, the art is really nice. Scenery abound in this sweeping platformer that offers endless hours of intricate. Also, I don't know if you can hear, but the we world is ending outside. This year, so that's fun. Hollow Knight was coming to Nintendo Switch, and I'm pleased to announce that the game, packed with all the previous downloadable content, is available. On the Nintendo eShop. Now. Yep, today. there you go. These are just a few of the terrific indie games you can play in the month. That's ahead. dope. After this presentation, stay tuned for Nintendo Treehouse. Sadly, I cannot, for I am going to convocate. Actually, I'll probably put it on the background. I won't be reacting anymore, but I'll have it on so that they can show off some stuff. The Treehouse Live is way better than anything. That Sony Sony's was so bad compared to every other. Like I can't believe it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Show us. Say, speaking of Super Smash Brothers, 
Nintendo Trilogy. Come on, man. Before we move on, I have an important update on a game I know fans have been looking forward to. Octopath yeah, man. Traveler from Square Enix is coming exclusively for Nintendo Switch. Final Fantasy VI 2. And you can download a brand new demo for the oh, game from the Nintendo cool. eShop. Yeah, I'm down. I'll give that a play. Now, let's take another action-packed look at some more experiences coming soon to Nintendo Switch. All right, dude, let's go. He said action-packed, so I don't think we'll get Animal Crossing here. What we got? Oh, yeah, Starlink. That's cool. I actually kind of want to get it just because it does... It's basically a new Star Fox game with how it how it is releasing with on the Switch, just with Fox there. Which, I... Yeah... Also, I'm 90% sure Minecraft already released, but okay. Sushi Strike. Oh, they're showing some that are already out. This game's apparently really good. Yep. More expansion. Get it? Why didn't they make a joke that it's the Donkey Kong expansion? Guys, I'm mad. Whoa, okay, so that leak was right. Why would you play that on a Switch? But okay. Mean cool. For those who really want to play a fighting game on a console that will not have people online. Do you even have enough buttons on the control? I guess you kind of do. Crash on a Nintendo console is weird to think about. What is this? It's like Splatoon third party? It's weird. This looks like some uh, Catan. FIFA. Okay, sure. I mean, I guess. I mean, sure, I guess. I mean, sure, I guess. Is there any... Yeah. I don't like Bethesda. Yeah, Dark Souls, that's a game, though. I don't even super into Dark Souls, but that's cool. Yes, K Heroes, that's more my jam. Yeah, Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate, I've already pre-ordered that, because that's dope. Wolfenstein. Bethesda again. Yeah, 20! The world ends with you, final remix. I'm super going down for that. Ball, very nice. Mega Man 11, yo, yo, yo! Blue Bomber back, baby! Okay, Mario Tennis, we've seen that. We've seen a lot of that. It's fun, I played it. It's a fighting game, pretty much. <gasps> Sakurai? Nope. Hi, everyone. I'm Shinya Takahashi of Nintendo. I hope you enjoyed what you've seen. Who is he? Recently, it's been nice Working to see people on. pull their Nintendo Switch systems from their bags to play, even when they have only a little. This is Animal Crossing. Every time I see I'm that, a freak. I can't help but smile. At Nintendo, we approach development with the goal of delivering new and unique games to surprise people all over the world, and we're thankful for the many publishing partners also making games for Nintendo Switch. Today, we share just a small portion of what we're currently working on. We hope you will look forward to what's coming next on Nintendo Switch.